Hi everyone, it's Gail, and I am here with Marguerite Miller, week 43. And as well, we're going to work on some decorating some ephemera and Kathy Holden Christmas journal. So let's say hi and hugs first to Vicki, Karen, Carol, and Kathy. Thank you so much for watching and your kind 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 comments okay let's do this thing we're gonna bust this out okay so what we need is something from a calendar so I have this calendar page here and I I love it because it's fall and hope is a waking dream it's very pretty so border or frame I have these tapeology frames I'm gonna use one of those brown paper bag or brown paper. I'm going to use this bag. A place. I found this lovely picture of this. Um, I guess it's, yeah, it's a house um, uh, in Philadelphia. And then handwriting. I have handwriting. Oh, and then in here, um, a symbol of heraldry which is like coats of arms and that kind of thing. I have some sort of close things in here, that stickers that I thought I might use. All righty then, let's get to it. I'm going to cut this out first things first. We're going to cut out the house. And um, yeah, so hope you're all having a good day. I have to tell you what I did. <laughs> What I do? Oh dear. I went ahead and started changing my craft room around. Oh my gosh. What was I thinking? So it's two people's fault. <laughs> it's my friend Carrie the crafter who when I was complaining about trying to get enough stuff near to me that I, you know, wasn't having to have you talk amongst yourselves all the time. Um, so he said, why don't you, because my room is like an L, like a capital L, you know, and this little space is where I film and everything. Carrie said, why don't you switch to your switch your filming and everything to the bigger part of your basement and then use the smaller part for storage of paper and everything. Well, it's a great idea. In theory, <laughs> in theory, it's a great idea. In reality, holy cow. But I started yesterday. And so yesterday I moved all of my journals so you know all the journals that i have purchased from other people or have been gifted to me i moved them that is well i have three shelves of journals and so there so there's that okay i'm not sure you know what i'm gonna tear this one too while i'm at it so these are um from one of my digital kits. I can't remember the exact name of it, but I really like the, the handwriting on it. So, um, yeah. So anyway, um, and one of them I got moved and I really like where it's at, really liking that. And the other one, not so much. So it's going to move again once I open up some more space. So, um, yeah, uh, but that's why I decided I'm not, I'm not doing anything that I just am like sort of living with, you know. I want everything I do to make me happy. <laughs> okay, the other thing I was thinking is I think I might tear off a bit of this. So... So yeah, I've started the process and uh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But 
I, I think it's going to be awesome when it's done. I really liked this too, but I just didn't want to as a place. Hmm. Now that I've torn that out. But see, then if I put this on, it covers the whole thing up. So that therein lies the problem. So we are going to just put a little of this on there, I think, for our handwriting. So, yeah, it's, uh, you know, the good thing is, is my furniture is pretty much so that I can, I can move it myself. I mean, I have, I do, I, you know, I don't have anything matching. I don't have anything fancy at all. Mostly what I have is leftovers from when I had my little bricks and mortar store. I had a little vintage store here in town. And um, so most of the pieces are are pieces that were still in my store when I closed. So, um, so they're, and they're smaller because doing my store, I mean, Mike helped me once in a while, but for the most part, I did all the hauling and putting of stuff <laughs> in my, um, in my little store. So I think I'm gonna just, do a little collaging here up here yeah so anyways um yeah I I don't know I think it'll be just fine now today after I do this video I think I'm gonna move my I'm gonna try to move my station but this is where my room is going to be and a complete disaster because um, I need to move one of my, I have big industrial shelves, you know, those wire ones um, that hold all my paper. I have two of those and I need to move them both so that I can set up for filming again. So, you know, I don't know, I might have to take a little break from filming. I'm filmed ahead, which is good, but um, yeah, I don't know. It, it does consume a lot of my brain though, you know, thinking about it. And, and I'm, I'm trying not to go through too thoroughly at this point because otherwise I'll never get it done. But I am trying to kind of go through and put things, you know, um, my giveaway boxes and and stuff like that I'm trying to do um, just so that you know it's just pared down a little bit so I don't know it may be a fool's errand I don't know but so I said two people were responsible so Carrie who said you know, why don't you flip-flop it? Which is a genius idea, as are all of Carrie's ideas. They're all genius. Um, oh, I should have left that on there, huh? Oh, well, we'll just put it there now. Anyway, um, and then the second person is Lorette Chandler because she's re she has redone her craft space because they put in new floors. Well, we don't have new flooring, but I can still kind of do, do something here. <laughs> I just want to make it a little more workable. And I am really excited because my work table is now going to be under my window, which is a basement window. So it's not like I can sit at my desk and look out, but I think it'll be some good light. And um, I think I'm going to use one of my ot lamps that I haven't used. Um, it's over behind me because it couldn't fit right here. I don't know why when I expanded my craft room, why I didn't put the um, put where I was filming out in the bigger area. I don't know. I just didn't think of it, I guess. Just not as genius as my pal Carrie, that's all. So, yeah, 
So anyway, that's what I'm up to. <laughs> and, you know, and then we're going to fit in some kid things. Because <laughs> um, my grandson has, uh, he's got a, a all-state choir con, con um, conference. Uh, anyway, it's all-state music thing. And I'm excited because he can try out. See, I'm thinking I'll just put that right there, maybe. But I want to decorate the bag some. So anyway, um, yeah, he will. He will have the opportunity to try out to um, to have a solo. But I guess they don't pick them beforehand. They wait until they're there. So we don't know yet if he's going to have that. But I think I told you in his spring concert, he had a solo. And oh my gosh, it was so, so wonderful. He sang Stand By Me. Oh my gosh, his other grandma and I were a ball of tears. <laughs> it was just so good. So yeah. So anyway, that's coming up and volleyball and stuff. So no grass growing under these grandparents' feet, that's for sure. <laughs> but it's like I, like I said to my, I, you know, in some ways, they all say thank you for coming and stuff like that. But I don't really think they understand, you know, how hard it is for a couple of old people to, to drive and, you know, and all of that. But, um... But they will someday. And some part of them knows they're supported. And that's really, that's really my main thing is I want them to know, you know, how, how supported they are, how much we love them. So, yeah. So, anyway, that's the scoop. <laughs> yeah, last night I was like, oh, man. Did I, did I hurt my back? Did I? <laughs> Moving so, well, the one, see, it's, it's my darn laziness is what it is. But I, um, I moved one of the shelves of journals without, <laughs> without unloading it. <laughs> well, that probably wasn't the smartest, but... And that's the one that needs to be moved again. I don't like it. It's I put it right beside uh, another shelf, and it's like just too much. It doesn't doesn't look good. So we'll redo that. And yeah, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just I'm just messing around here while I'm blabbing at you. Yeah, so anyway, um, Mike's been busy doing fall work outside, but what else has he been doing? Well, he's taking a cable box back today because um, that was one thing I moved out. I do not have a TV down here anymore. I never watched it, you know. If I... If I was watching a video on while I was while I'm crafting, I would just I maybe will go right here. I don't know. Um anyway, if I was if I was doing that, it would be either on my phone or iPad or laptop, you know. I've got lots of options, and so the TV was taken up. Where was I going to put that? Over here, wasn't I? The TV was taken up room that could be, you know, could be storage room. So I decided out it goes. So it's up in our um, guest room now. So anyway, so Mike's doing that. Yesterday he cleaned out gutters. He was trying to fix our hot tub, but... I think it's beyond fixing, and we don't hardly ever use it, so it's going bye-bye. Okay, so what I'm thinking is of putting 
this like with a frame around it. That's kind of where my brain was going. So let's check out these frames. I don't know if I'm going to get a frame around it or if I'm going to have to just put a frame by it or something. Because I don't know. Well, maybe this one. That about works. Okay, so I haven't used these yet, so I'm anxious to I think I'm gonna put my I'm gonna put my house down and then we'll go from there. So yeah, so anyways, busy busy, you know. Just just having fun. So my friend came over yesterday. I'm very excited. She's thinking of doing an Etsy. So if she does and everything, I will certainly keep you up to date. I'll do a in an Etsy share or something. So oh yeah, that kind of works. Yeah, that works. So um she makes the most beautiful things. Well, she's a quilter too. Um, how'd I how'd I get to be friends with all these quilters? I don't know when I'm random Rachel random Roberta <laughs> random somebody um but I did and um but she has been making some cards and she's been making some little naked journals that um and then she kind of gives you some fun papers to work with so yeah, so I'm really excited for it. Now, I think these are stickers. That's what the deal is. Let's see here. Like so, yes. So, um, she came over to just kind of pick my brain a little bit and stuff. And I said, okay. Let's go this way. Um, it's... I said, I'd love for you to just come over and we'll have a crafty day. So I think she's going to do that one of these days, which will be awesome. Um, she's a friend that actually I met. I had a, a short time where I didn't work at the college. That's a long story. But anyway, um, well... <laughs> Let's make it scrunchy. Let's make it look like it's supposed to look like that. <laughs> um, so anyway, um, I worked at an insurance company for a while and she was working with a temp agency and she came into my department and was a temp there. I'm just going to put this on as if I'm going to use a pocket on the side. I'm not, but I could. And, you know, no sense gluing all this down, all this space. So, yeah. So, anyway, um, and she's so delightful. Hi, Darby, if you're watching. She watches sometimes, I think. Um, so, anyways, I'm very excited. I hope... It'll all go well. Her her daughter has an Etsy shop, I guess. And so, um, you know, she can be helpful as far as any questions that she might have. I, I need to punch those. Oh, goodness. Need to do something different with my punches. That's... One of, oh, that just fell off, on it. That's one of the things that I'm feeling is I need something different for them because they're just not handy to grab. Oh, gosh. Sorry, I'm probably off camera, but... That was harder than it should have been. Okay. Alrighty then. Where are we at? 
we are, oh, her heraldry. We need to do that. Let's get this cut down a bit. heard from a lot of you that you're excited to do next year's and I am too. So I think I'm going to put that there. Now, heraldry. Okay, so we didn't use those. There's a scrap. Those over there. Grab this. Oh gosh. I've got all my Christmas stuff here to the side and so as usual, my I'm I'm going to get a new another foot because my table is five feet and I'm going to use a six foot table, in my new spot. So coat of arms ish, like I thought this kind of was, and this kind of not really but kind of, and this. So. Close as I could get. I'm going to use these because why not? So I think with this one, I'm just going to go right down here. Give that a little something. And then this guy is going to go up here. Yeah, so I don't know, guys. You may have some time where you're, like, being patient with me because I can't find things. <laughs> because I've moved. Okay, and then this little horsey guy is somewhat coat of arms-ish. Okay, there's our page. There it is for this time. So, something from a calendar, border or frame, brown paper bag, uh, symbols of heraldry, a place, and handwriting. Boom! Done. So, there we go. Okay. Ugh. Okay, so let's get rid of this. And... Now, let's see where we are on our Christmas journal, which is what I wanted to do, I think, is, is decorate these. Now, there's birdies and such there. Okay, let's just put you here for now. Put you back over here. And let's dig into what we've got to decorate with, um, which is so much fun stuff. Okay, let's see. So these are the two that I've been taking out of. I have one or two of each of these because I knew I was gonna use a ton. So I like that. Oh, look how easy. Okay, I see another sideways thing. Jingle bell. Keep losing the jingle bells. This one. And it's got birds. Okay, well, that's pretty perfect. Might need a little something more. Like, I like, I really like this stamp right here. put that kind of right there. Okay, well, this come together real easy peasy. Okay, jingle bells, get back in there. I don't want to lose you. Oh, here's another jingle bell. And another jingle bell. <laughs> okay, we're, we're set. Oh, what fun. So anyway, well, I have, I will say my, my decorating, <laughs> decorating slash moving, mostly moving at this point, um, has kind of energized me. So, you know, 
I've had my room like this, what, probably at least three years, if not closer to four. So um, it's time for a little change. And I just, I, I don't know. It's like this table, or this, my, my white hutch. It's just, it's really full of stuff. And it's like, I need to get a better system on some stuff, I think. Because, you know, I do, I really do work best. I'm actually thinking of putting those on as pockets now that I have my glue stick at hand. Because why not? I mean, maybe even if I don't, I don't put anything in there, maybe whoever has has this journal will want to yeah so um there cute okay um yeah it it's kind of making me excited to go through stuff i think my folks that my friends that attend my retreats are going to benefit from the overflow. That's, that's the truth of it. And I also think, I told my husband, that my fireplace um, hearth is just kind of where I set stuff that is going on Etsy. I said, I think the fireplace hearth is going to be full. <laughs> Um, so yeah, we're just, we're just going to clean out a little bit. So what we're going to do. Okay. Do we need anything else is what I'm looking at. Um, like lace or trim or anything. I think it'll, it'll look more full as we get stuff in there. I just saw something that might be nice in there. This little, this little card. Ooh, that's good right there because it doesn't cover up the birdies and I wanted the birdies to show. So I'm going to use this. And we're just going to Kathy hold in this pocket right up. So... Yeah, the, the paper shelves are going to be a big old job. Kind of, kind of noivous for that. I like this red too. Mm, I must have a hole somewhere that these bells keep falling out of. I don't know. But I'm thinking... Some red would be nice. Oh, isn't that nice there? That's great. Okay. You're getting a good look at Kathy's ephemera through these through the process, aren't you? Okay, so that's good. Um I'd like something blue. Oh my gosh, look how cute that is. But it's not quite right for that, so that's okay. How tall is this? Okay, that could fit. That's kind of cute. Want that to decorate something although I do have another set I gotta remember that and if I put this in there loose the person who gets this journal might find a spot where they think that should go so okay so that's gonna go there um down here what would we like let's check this out 
There's another birdie. I might put that in there just to sort of indicate that that's a pocket. And then they might draw the conclusion, oh, I think the upper one's a pocket too. Oops, right here. Okay. I think that's pretty good. Let's just say that's good. And let's see, our journal. Let's put that right here. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Isn't that pretty? Okay, that's great. Now I have. Oh yeah, we're going to do um we're going to do a belly band with this. This is what we are going to do. So, I want some paper. Let's see what kind of pattern that's pretty. And it's kind of plain. Or the red, which do we want, green or red? Oh, we're on green, so let's do red. Okay, I'm gonna grab that red, this one. Okay. Oh, isn't it fun? It's just so much fun. Let's see, what are those scraps? I don't know. This could come in handy, maybe. On it. Okay. All right. Okay. Um, okay. I think I am just going to Hair down. Let's see where we get to. Okay, I need my ruler that's keeping my place there. I think I'll remember that it was kind of on the bottom there. Okay. So that's good. And then I think I want some music. Okay. Gosh, I'm a little bit hungry. I've got a little hungry happening. Not hangry, not yet, <laughs> but hungry. This is copyright 1900. Wow. I kind of would like that. I'll just let that tear where it wants to. And I'm going to put that on there. Two. Okay. Well, first of all, let's give this a little something. Oh, I feel like, you guys, I feel like it's going to be the point of no return when I go start this process. Yikes. I'm nervous. I am a little ahead in my filming, though. Oh, that doesn't need to be. Um, and so... If I make such a big mess that I can't film for a few days, I think it's I'll be okay. But but it's kind of like once I start this, I got to go. I mean, I got to keep going because everything's going to be torn to smithereens. And of course I decide to do this when I have Christmas all out and everywhere. Why wouldn't I do that? I don't know. <laughs> Oh, night the not the brightest Christmas light, am I? In the string. Not the brightest Christmas light on the string. Okay, I like that one. <laughs> well, 
if the socket fits. <laughs> Come on. Oh, you can see it's going to be a crazy day. Oh, bless my husband. He's like, I don't have a whole ton to do today, so I can help you move some stuff. I'm like, I I know he doesn't really want to help, help, help me like empty shelves and stuff, but that's really what the big job's going to be, I feel like. So, I don't know. He's so helpful on a lot of things. I hate to hate to abuse his kindness. <laughs> oh, goodness. Oh, and guess what? He made a cheesecake yesterday. He said, that's, that's one thing I got to do today is finish my cheesecake so we can have some tonight. And I'm like, yep, yep, you do. Okay. I'll pop that down there. And I don't know if I'm going to do something with this. Maybe. What do we want to decorate this with, though? Therein lies the question. Um, I get my little bits here. Well, we've got this bookmark. Maybe we could just layer up a few. Do I have Tim Holtz Christmas people? I feel like I might. Okay, so that's cute there. What if... We kind of go like that. And then put a focal point on there of some sort. Um, I got to flip around and see if I have Tim Holtz people. Because I think that would be a good spot for them. Ah. I felt like I had... Those are seem like regular people. These seem like Halloween-y people. Okay. Are these just regular folk? Oh, I wonder. This, I think, is the, what do they call them? Doubles or whatever. Maybe. Okay. Hmm. I think I want a Tim Holtz person, but I got to get the singles. Okay, can I find someone in a coat? Probably. Someone bundled up. Oh, that kid's cute, but he's too little. Because I think Tim Holtz would go well with Kathy Holden. Okay, I'm going to get these on there. I'm going to need some good nutrition for lunch so that I have lots of energy to do this thing. I wish I had like about like about four of you that could come over and help me. <laughs> oh, it'll be good. I think I'll love it when it's done. But, you know, I just keep doing things in my head when I'm supposed to be sleeping. So, I need to I need to get it done so I can sleep again. Okay, let's find some bundled up person. Okay, okay, people. No, 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 no. I would like. Just one person, but maybe I won't. They'd be kind of cute. P 
put something across for their feet. They have to sit on something, and she needs something on her elbow. Okay, well, they're a possibility. Where's those people that... I'm going to go with those people. Okay. Um, let's see. They need something to stand on, don't they? here. I think that would be good. And then um, I'm going to put a label or something at the top. It'll go straight across that line. And that leaves the flowers showing too. Okay, so they're going to go right there. <clears throat> spots that could use a little something. Okay. I'm wondering about putting some lace poking out the sides of the belly band as well. Thinking about that. Okay. Now, right about there. That's where they're going. <laughs> okay, let me smooth those down a bit. Okay, there they are. Now, Just looking at this little cigar band. Ooh, I like that there. And then something at the top. We'll see what. I think I could just use this. Since it's coming out all gloppy, I'm still on that glue stick. Okay, there's that. All right. Something, something. And um, let's look. Mm -hmm. Don't see anything in my words. My Vintage Studio 717 had some little, little things. That's cute. You know, all this fussy cutting I did in Christmas Pass is coming in real handy this year. <laughs> okay, so we'll put that on and then we'll think about the um, lace. Put that right there. Okay. Okay, that's decorated up. Now let's see. Um, okay, I want to look at it on the page here for a second. Uh-oh, my tub just fell over. Excuse me for a second. Okay, 
Oh, heat's on, I'm warming up. That's gonna be an advantage of being across the room too. The heat is gonna be more consistent and and the cooling actually in the summer too. I don't know that I want any, I don't think I do. I'm gonna leave that just as is. Okay. So, I think we're to putting things in. How are we doing time-wise? We've got about 15 minutes. Let's glue some stuff into Kathy. Put those up for the moment. Oh, okay. I need a new glue page too. All right, here we go. Here we go. So we've got this. And that's going to go right there. And how stinking cute is that? I love that. Little. I don't know. I just. I just think all of Kathy's little embellishments and everything. They're just. I love them. They're just right up my alley as far as style goes and stuff. So. Okay. So there's that. Page. Oh, and then we've got this big old guy, and I think it can go like sideways. Something can go in there. So let's do that. Um, for new people, a hint is to hold your piece on the side that you don't want to glue. It can save you a lot of heartache. <laughs> so, okay, so there's that one. Good, good, good. Okay, love that. Ooh, then, and then the Starbucks, that just kind of cracks me up. Okay, we already put on the fabric flip, so that's good. Here's another pocket. So let's do that. Okay. There you go. It's a little curly, so I'm going to have to hold this for a second, I think. All righty. So that's there. I'm gonna give that a little of this. Cause my fingers just aren't cutting it. Oh, that's so cute. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, then we have our postcard. Oh, and the digital of this one is I'm gonna have to look. It's a, I think it's, oh, it's in here. It is Vintage Christmas, Mixed Media Minnesota. That's what it is. Okay, and this is going to be a tuck spot. So we are just going to glue here, down the side, and there, and put that along the page. Like so, and something could be tucked in there. I just am loving working with this stuff. Thank you, Kathy, for sharing your amazing talent with us all. Okie dokie. That one. It's going to go there. Oh, I'm excited to find stuff to put in the in the pockets too. Oh, I just love 
this one. Okay, I think that's down pretty well. Then we go this side and we're gonna glue here, 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 and here. So, okay, what do I do with my, it's under there. Okay, I'm just going to put this on top for the moment. And then here. I'm going to glue this so that if you wanted to, you could put a tag in back. Like that. <clears throat> okay. this little postcard okay. and this little pocket isn't on it's just her ephemera and everything. It's just so bright and happy. I love it. Okay, put that one here. come to our our belly band I'm gonna go down a skosh because I think this might be a little bit taller than the page just slightly so there we go This guy. I think I'm gonna have him so that something can be put in the side. Oh. Need the glue to actually come out of the bottle. There we go. Um, I have, I should mention this too, I have put in my my yearly fall order for art glitter glue because, um, as you know, they, it doesn't ship if it's too cold. And so I kind of stock up in the fall and then I don't have to order again. It's available on my favorite things on my website, which is always in the description box if you're needing to stock up too. the edge. I remember that this one was was close. So, okay, we got everything all glued in. How are we doing time-wise? Gosh, we've we're good. Um I'm just looking at this vintage Christmas card in there I don't know. that's kind of nice isn't it It's 
too too big okay well i think we will call it a video here and just um think about what we might want to put where i mean one of these postcards would be fun in here That's not really vintage. Oh, look at this. Look at this. It's, it's Christmas carols. That would be cute in there. Okay. That's happy. She says, let's, let's be done. And then she keeps going. Okay. Well, we just need to fill the pockets on this one now. And we may need to make some stuff to fill the pockets with. So, thank you so much for watching here. Here is our little um, Marguerite Miller. And so we got a few things done. So thanks so much for watching, everyone. I hope you have a grateful day. And I hope to see you in the next video if I survive the move. <laughs> we'll see you next time, everybody. Bye.